I'm going to have to brush Ben. He's starting to lose his hair. Getting ready for the winter. Getting rid of the old hair. So what I do, I brush one side because it takes a while. And he's really hot with it. And uh, I'll do one side. And then, see it just comes out in chunks. And uh, then later on do the other side. I know, look at it. And the birds love this. Yeah, that's your hair. He'll feel so much cooler. But uh, anybody's thinking about getting a Great Pyrenees, they can really shed. And I see some of um, the dogs not be brushed at all. Uh, with gobs of hair hanging off of them. So that's what I'm going to have to do. Start brushing him. One side at a time. I got one side of Ben. Come here. Hey. I got one side of his hair all nice and pretty and smooth, soft. And it took about an hour. Then I got this side to do. <laughs> we still got some more work. This side to do, and it's still just hanging out and uh, needs to be brushed. So I'm giving him a break. Give me a break. If you ever get you a Great Pyrenees puppy, start them out early on getting groomed because they gotta have patience because it takes a long time. Uh, their neck, his neck isn't, the hair's not falling out of his neck too much because they both have a big mane on them. And he's not losing that as fast, but all down in here. He's losing a lot of hair. So, that's the workout. And he don't like it. I don't like it. Well, it's not too bad. I started him out as a puppy getting brushed. So he's pretty patient with me. And uh, he was just glad to get that side done. And that's what I do. One side at a time. This is one side of Ben. And... If somebody don't like grooming dogs, don't get Pyrenees because you got to groom them. Brush them up. I'll do this two more times in the fall because he's still shedding. <laughs> and he's going to look so pretty after. Ellen, I'll give him a big old hug for you after I groom him up because he'll be soft like a fuzzball. I also, when I groom him, or any of the dogs, I squirt him down with a squirt bottle. Because this dry air we have, it will uh, make their fur shock with static. And it hurts them and they'll pop me. So I'm always squirting him down when I'm brushing him. Now i got to go empty this. And, and the birds love it. If they find it, they'll make their homes for the winter with it they're they'll be nice and cozy so thanks for watching from out west homestead bye he's about had enough